What about nine grand, man? And this is this is fair. I mean, movie. for for what it is, I. What's going on, everybody? I want to appreciate y'all for tuning in. The video you're about to watch, I actually had a viewer reach out to me that he got some coins from a guy. He wanted me to take a look at them, told me he was interested in selling them. And the deal is probably, I think it's close to one of the biggest deals I've ever done. So stick around, check out the video, leave me a comment, and tell me what you think. All for whatever. All the weight of everything? Yeah, so like I did weigh these ones and like my scale weighted at 27 for this one and 26 for this one. Yeah, they got wear and stuff. Some, yeah, so. sometimes they have wear, so yeah, they'll yeah. wear a little bit. Did you guys get any idea what you were thinking? Have you looked them up? Or I know the prices are all over the place and yeah, for wh whatever it is that you want. So like, I, I think the main ones that have the most value, I just want to make sure like they're legit. And then if they are legit, then you know, that would bring the price up to like, you know. Are like you thinking what? anything? Do you have any any we do we idea? do we do kind of have like price, what but we kind of we kind of want to just make sure like they are real. Right, but if they are, if they are, is what I'm saying because it just takes a little bit to go through everything, and it'll take us like an hour to no, I, I know, to do I anything. Know. But like I said, you, I have, what are you even thinking? So like, if they are legit, with the whole book, I really think. There's probably like fifteen thousand dollars worth of if, if total these, value, or that's what you want to get. Total over to fifteen in value here. I'm not asking. I'm not saying that. So what? That's, do you, what do you think is fair for you guys to? That's get? why I say the only the only thing about the only thing that makes it hard when coming up with like a price like that is now if they were if everyone was graded, you can go easily. Last one sold for this. Last no, one sold I, for that. I get that. that. And that's the like, thing. Being like, subjective on what a grade will come out because on a coin that's like if that one's 3700 see i think this coin when this person did it i really think that this is probably like a 5500 dollars coin if it's legit yeah so yeah, that's if where it, a lot if it, of your now, money's coming from this one this one a few on this one yeah yeah but like so, so what like, would you want out of that is what i'm saying what would you if you think it's worth around 15 what what do you think is fair to you guys probably close to 10. And the hardest thing to say, like if one is, like say this one was cleaned, which I don't know, it would. If they're cleaned, it, it would, destroys, it destroys them. them. And, and obviously, like that's, obviously that price is dependent on the majority the, of these. I that's mean, why they, I look, they look good. I mean, I don't see why they wouldn't be looking at them offhand. How, how did you come up with 55? Did you come up with a grade for it? Yeah, so like when I looked up the grade, and this is that's that's fifty five just based on it being graded, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, and, and grading. And I don't know how much a grading is, and that's why like but like did I, you look up a specific grade of that? Going by the very fine that this person has. Oh, very fine. Okay. And like I said, I I do like eBay. I have my own store. Like I have like eighteen hundred listings on there. So like I but this is not. Something. I wouldn't sell something like this on yeah. eBay. I this mean. Is, when you when you get up to that much money, people can take it, change one, do that's things. That's what I was telling him, I mean, you know, and that's and that's like that's like the main thing because I wouldn't know. Are these the are this, like the two different books? Yeah. Yeah, this is an earlier, yeah, this earlier is. years, and then this is twenty years after. It's so hard to tell if a coin's been cleaned, man. I've seen them before where it's like one will come back graded and it'll say cleaned and it don't look like it was at all so they're very very hard to unless it's like the other thing people do too is put they'll take like a 1893 f or 1893 philadelphia what don't have a mint mark mm -hmm. put the they'll S put on a, they'll put a mint mark on it so that's a big way that they they do on which this one look i mean it, like I said, I, I mean, I've been buying off this guy for like a year now, so, you know, he just happened to come across these and like... Where did he get them? Do you know? So, he, like I, like I told you, son, he works for like a donation company, and what I'm assuming happened was person may have died, he and the people... Steal. 
Yeah, I don't know how much he's into it, but he, I think, because he picks it up, and then he'll bring it to, like, somebody there. They'll give him a price, and then he buys it. And then that's how he sources his stuff, because he did eBay. And then I buy from him now. So, like, he had a little one, so he spends most of his time with his little one. And he's trying to, mm -hmm. you know, and he's trying to, um, you know, join the police, too. So, like, his time is busy, so he sold all his inventory to me. And so these are yours or his still? Or both yours? Or you you guys are working together? Correct. Okay. What's the heavy one in there? The heavy ones? Um, I used, I was just going by these. But these could be like out of like... Um, and some of, these, some of these don't have any value. So I can tell you a lot of people, when it's your coin, you tend to grade it higher. <laughs> I, I'm just telling you. No, people no, tend no. to try no, like to get I the said, best out of their... That's why, that's why yeah. obviously I came here. Because I felt like you're well, signing. Well, brilliant uncirculated. I mean, that you have to really look yeah. at that because brilliant uncirculated means it has never touched people's hands. Basically, yeah, it, it means it's not uncirculated. It's almost a you know. Yeah, to way I feel, I, I feel like you guys will at least give me what is worth on top of you guys making money. I mean, like, I understand, like, you guys have to make money and stuff like that. Yeah. I but mean, I, I don't want to get gypped off. No, no. Yeah, Both yeah, of you try to be fair to everybody. 100%. Yes. It's just putting out 10 grand. I mean, it is, you got to be sure because no, yeah, one wrong way, either or, you're I, Yeah, you're I losing. get it. I get it. And, you know, that's why, like, you know, we can do whatever it takes for you guys to feel comfortable. And yeah. How you doing? Good. Yeah, um, I met you at my yard sale okay. a couple months ago. Right. And you bought a gold bracelet from me. Oh, yeah, yeah, I remember. And I said I'd make it in here one Nine. day with some stuff. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, 54. I think it's 54. I think it's 54. And it's hard to find. It's hard to take it all in, man. How many is actually here and what's here and looking at. I guess there was some common. You can think about it or shop it around or whatever, man. Like, but I don't know, like, you know, don't feel pressure. I mean, I did try to do a little bit, and it does seem like it's pretty close. But some of it is sometimes better. You know, when you got diamonds and stuff, people put value on those. They all look good. I mean, I don't see nothing that sticks out that looks fake. Yeah, but when you're dealing with this, I don't, <laughs> I don't want to even. What about nine grand, man? And this is, this is fair. I as mean, for be. for what it is, I like you said, you resell. I got to make a little bit on them, and it, like I said, it is kind of gambling paying that much, man. I mean, I think at that price. I'm not gonna lose, but it's you're risking on what you think these grades and stuff are and what he graded them at. I mean, I so I mean, I understand that, but the way I see it is that even when I calculated everything, I thought it was around 15. And this, and we can go through the pages and see how many I didn't even mm -hmm. even calculate. Like I don't know, I'm pretty sure there's probably well more than 10. But when you're going fifth, oh, you, but you were going by these, and man, that makes a difference. It'll double. No, no, no. It'll I, I mean, technically, I was just going by these little prices. And so, oh, and what this, he thought they would be worth? And 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 like like so like this one, right? He had it at. 30, I thought you were looking at the at the mint mark. He had this one at thirty-seven. The, I think this is more. You know what I'm saying? But he's got so, one about uncirculated, and it's hundred percent cleaned. So very fine is very subjective, man, to what will come out. And if I've that seen coins, these fetch. I mean, if they you're going to get, not, you're going to get easily. The other thing is, too, I think half your money back just on that one alone. Mm -hmm. What do they go? They go for over five grand. They're in that they condition. are expensive, they, but, but in that it just it worries. Yeah, they are expensive. It just worries me. They're, they're, and really you're and you're taking like, cash and walking yeah. out, and we got to try to figure out someone to buy these What's things. Right? And, and and don't take that the wrong way. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm not at all saying that it's not good or whatever. It's just. And it's just hard to put that much out, and then to find someone that's going to pay twelve or thirteen thousand. No, 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 no. That, that's why. I, that's the way I see it. Is that I think. That yeah, I'm just a smaller shop, man. I don't take and stuff like that I really. Think even if there was 
Because if I mean I can go ahead and count each one that I didn't even count. Everything else interesting. You know, not too much, man. Yeah. And I think some of these values. Yeah, come across I don't know when seven, these values were, were, were put in, but that could be you know it could be a little higher, it could be a little, higher, higher, be a little lower. lower. Yeah. Like but so. The other thing too, man, to to I mean to sell them, and you know in the resale world is to find the buyer that's going to buy that for 3700 like to find that guy putting this in his collection is, is, I don't think you have a problem with that. No, I'm saying it's hard to find that buyer now if you're selling them to somebody like you're selling them to me to make a little bit I can sell them to a guy that a higher end guy that he might make a little bit but to find that buyer that's yeah. going to pay top premium for that coin and he's going to give us 13 or 14 thousand dollars they're tough I mean, it's, they're tough it's not it ain't like yeah, turn all that quick. the big ones I don't think you'll have a problem with it. you know like the higher I mean they always have to be a collection you, on this because I, I hate to take these out and be at 40 30 20 50 and then sell the high ones for more someone's gonna probably pay something for the collection but I don't know if they're gonna pay 15 like 13 thousand 12 thousand I, I don't know that they're gonna pay that much it's just a lot to get to get there, even I mean, with a big coin, you know, he'll they're gonna look at that and pick it apart, just not like we, kind of like we are, but he's gonna say, Oh man, that is not very fine. Mm -hmm. I'm a coin guy, Th this is a, a $2,800 coin. It all depends on that, man. It depends on this coin. So I say, Man, you're it, and I you can't just pay top if you understand it's one. gambling, but it's not gambling, <laughs> like the money's here, it's like gambling. You, you're it's gonna gambling. get you're gonna get money for it. That might be right. a fake coin, it's yeah. gambling. You're gonna I get, mean, you're gonna just, get money for okay, it regardless. Fine. Then go through all the ones that I didn't even do it, even at 15, and just see how many they are. That well, I, I didn't even I don't think it. I can get 15 for that though, because I'm not, I, I'm not gonna find that buyer that's gonna add that coin to his collection. I'm gonna sell it to a guy that he's gonna try to make a few hundred dollars off of it. Or whatever he's gonna try. if he's paying that much, he's gonna want to make something off of it. because tying up ten grand for that long and trying to find that buyer, you tied that money for a long coin. time. Yeah, man. So like, you're saying that you're gonna try and sell the collection as a collection? Not just probably. Like that? I'll, I'll shop it, it around depend. and see it what I'm gonna depend. do with it because I know I do know some high end coin collectors and and guys that sell at shows and stuff like that. So they might know somebody looking for that. I I don't know, but I'm tying up nine ten grand. You know. Yeah. So it's not, it's not like it's not like you got a fifteen thousand dollar piece of gold, and I can take it to my guy and I can melt it and yeah, I'll make that brought in gold. It's a, it's you know, a simple deal. These it's, are it's in and out. Uh, these are coins take a special are buyer man to pay four thousand dollars for you a coin. A I don't have that clientele that would pay these. If you think this coin's worth more, what I do is I I, I give you the nine for it, and anything over. 37 this coin sells for you. I'll split it with you So if that went for so if it went for six grand, I'd give you 1500 $1, $1, $1, $1, $1, $1, $1, $1, $1, bucks if it goes for five grand. I'd give you another Whatever half a thousand dollars or whatever But all right, let me do this. Let me call him up just to make sure I'll, I'll, I'll tell him the thing that he said 9,000 if that $3,700 one turns out to be I'll a little split thing. with you okay. Yeah, I, or if we get more than a, you know, yeah, more or than if I a certain amount, so we'll, we'll also yeah, give you some money. Yeah, I'll, be, I'll be watching that video. Uh, oh, right. yeah, you're good, man. You'll be what? Watching that video. Uh, we'll tell, I'll call you and tell you. Yeah, I, if, I was, if I was doing something shady, I wouldn't put it on the video. <laughs> <laughs> I, had to I know if it wasn't on the video. That defeats the purpose, yeah. So anything for this coin over that, yeah. over the 37. Or, man, even if it gets, if I paid you nine and it got like 17 grand or something, yeah, for we're going to give you a couple man. thousand more. But obviously, not, if I got that much, that would mean this coin would come back pretty high. Either way, either what he's saying is even if we sell this as a collection yeah. and someone says, hey, I'll give you 15, we're going to give you a thousand bucks, two thousand, whatever. Well, whatever, whatever he offers, yeah, we'll give they, you guys some it, more. If they were graded and I could see, I could offer you a good price, tell you what it is, and I'd figure I'm making what I'm going to make. With this, it's kind of subjective to what you think that greed comes back at. If you want to do that, you're good with it and I'll Yeah. No, he said it was he said it was found All right. All right, cool. Yeah. I appreciate it, man. Right. And and I think it's fair right now. And if it wasn't fair, we're gonna be in touch with you, trust me. We'll get your number and everything and if it wasn't fair you're gonna we'll make it fair. We just don't know what fair is right now. <laughs> that's that's our problem.
I mean, so. I, I kind of it's kind of close. It's close one way or the other. But we might be a thousand, a couple thousand off that what we owe you. So I mean, no, I'll keep it real with you. He originally was like thinking three thousand, and then get four thousand out of there. <laughs> and um, I'm glad you did. I'm glad you guys know what it's worth. I actually did a little bit more research, and he came out with like five yesterday. And then I was like, dude, I'm gonna shoot for the stars, and that's just that. Well, no, you that's know, good, bro. Because I good. added everything up, and it just well, that's what I told you. If you would have told me four thousand, I would have said, hey, man. I you probably, probably got you would more not. Money. You probably would not have given you four thousand dollars. So. Hey, when I was sending you those I don't pictures, do, we don't I do just that. picked them up. I didn't yeah. do anything. I didn't do. I think it's fine, but man, you just don't know. Is there another one of these things, or no? I don't think so. No, just that. Just the one. Cool. Came up. Right. Like I said, I appreciate it. Uh, right. What was your name again? Junior. Junior? Oh, yeah, yeah you told me. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I got I got your number on that text, so I'll oh, yeah, stay yeah. in touch with you. So. Cool. Nothing See else what it does. Nope. You're, you're good, good, brother. You're good, man. Thanks. All right, man. So the last thing we have to get to is the giveaway. But before that, there's a couple things I want to talk about in that video. So I put one comp up. This was the one right here. And on eBay, I had a friend reach out to me. So you got to be careful when you look at comps also because people take offers on stuff. So this website right here, this was originally made for, they were manipulating card prices. I had a friend of mine, Mike, reach out to me. I appreciate you. And he showed me this website. This will show what somebody took on an offer. So the comp I put up of the one that went for six grand, it actually sold for, I think it was 5350 the other thing about buying these coins is you know there's there is a big risk when it comes to buying ungraded coins because counterfeit is such a huge thing i've put them on a couple sites and seen what some people thought of some groups i follow and there were some questions even with that 1893s and one of them was the weight one guy said the weight was a little off here's the weight of it right here but coins do lose a little weight when it comes to where how much you know that's uh, you know when you're buying stuff like that that's the scary part of it so he was saying they do use silver where it will slide off the magnet um it'll fool it'll fool that machine because it is silver so another thing was a guy said that like i told the guy in the video they take coins and then they add a mint mark to it which is a big thing in counterfeit so just buying a coin like that is is very scary when you're putting out nine ten thousand dollars you know so today's the seventh in Florida. They have anybody that knows anything about coins. One of the biggest coin shows in the U.S. is the FUN Coin Show, and luckily that coin show is next week. So we're gonna take them there before I do anything with them, and I'm gonna see. You know, there's a lot of really experts there. The some of the most knowledgeable coin people you can find is gonna be at that show. So they'll know. And um, you know, if I can't get the price I want for it, we'll probably just send it in and get it graded see what it comes back at. So I don't really know exactly what we're gonna do with it, but we're gonna take it there and see what kind of offers we can get and see what people think about it. So if you're just tuning into the channel, this is your first video. I usually give something away every Friday. This is what we're giving away this Friday. Next Friday, I have bought some, well my dad bought some silver from a yard sale. We'll probably give some of this away maybe next Friday. And then don't forget, at 10,000 subscribers, we're doing 10 gold coins for 10 weeks. So we're going to give 10 10th ounce gold coins away. So this week, this is the last one of these I have. We're going to go ahead and give this away. So we got the link to the video. Filter duplicate users. We'll get the comments. There's 10. So to be entered for the drawing, you have to like comment and subscribe to the videos so subscribe like and comment on the videos that gets you in for the drawing to win so we're going one winner for the graded morgan ms63 beautiful coin one lucky winner caveman 911 so caveman 911 Go ahead and message me right here on Instagram. That's the easiest way for you to contact me. And then what I ask you to send me, that's how I verify the winners. So I appreciate y'all for tuning in. I hope y'all enjoy the video. I know there's a lot of coin guys on here. You know, leave me a comment. Tell me what you think about those coins. You know, tough to buy when they're like that. 
the guy that brought them, Junior, I appreciate you for reaching out to me. And until next time.